eight games, the 8-8 eight and eight Lakers get LeBron James back in the lineup for a big one tonight against the Boston squad that has been playing much better of late, particularly on the defensive end. We'll get into the Celtics a little later on. GA, let's start with LeBron. What does it mean? I'm going to ask you the Captain Obvious question here. <laughs> what does it mean for the Lakers to get LeBron James back in the lineup? You know, in a weird way, I, I think their season begins tonight. <laughs> yep. And I say that because this is going to be about them developing continuity and an identity. You know, we know obviously Frank Vogel wants to be a defensive-oriented coach, but you also have to figure out who you're going to be. What's your, what's your rotation? Who's going to be in? Who's going to be out? How we're going to play down the stretch. Finding that balance between he and Russell Westbrook in terms of the ball. Uh, integrating AD. Like, they, they've got so many moving parts, Grant, that it, it's a challenge to get that figured out, and you really need the regular season in order to do that. No question. A lot of new faces this year, uh, important pieces, West, Westbrook, Anthony. Did you say Westbrook? I said Westbrook. Oh, okay. Excuse me. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, uh, Jeez, Derek Fisher. I, I, had oh. oral, I had oral surgery last week. Oh, is that what it was? Yeah. Um, but no, I mean. That Novocaine a week later? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Lingering effects. <laughs> wow. <laughs> <laughs> You, these guys are a trip. Do um, yeah. we need to get tested before we go no. on the air? What's going on? <laughs> but no, seriously, I mean, I, I, I agree with you, Greg. Um, Le LeBron, it, you can't evaluate this team without LeBron in the mix. And, you know, so much is centered around what he does, what he brings to the table. Obviously, his versatility, his leadership. Uh, he elevates every team that he's on and, and, and brings with that a championship expectation. So, um, yeah, no, I agree. The season starts now. I just want to see his health. That 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 abdominal strain, abdominal yeah. injury. I, I you know I had that among many injuries throughout my career. Had had to have surgery on it. Um, but that that's something that can be difficult. And you know, it's one thing when you're in a controlled environment. You're here now shooting jump shots before the game. You might be working on things. Uh, but now when you get that uncontrolled environment where you're you're reacting defensively, reacting to what the defense is doing. That's when you test it. So it'll be interesting to see how he moves tonight. We'll see that early on. And then just, you know, if he doesn't fatigue, he can sustain throughout this game and, and throughout the rest of uh, the next upcoming games. But certainly a lot of excitement seeing him back uh, for, for the Los Angeles Lakers faithful. And, uh, you know, he, he, you know, season starts. I agree with Greg.